actually filming this intro like in the middle of this vlog so basically I filmed the intro but I thought it looked really weird like the coloring and I realized uh, like halfway through filming today that the brightness like it was on a weird setting so it made like everything yellow so I'm filming this now that I'm home but basically what you guys are gonna see in today's vlog is I went wedding dress shopping today for Brianna it's also her birthday so it was such an exciting day she did find her dress so I have a ton of clips from that you guys love the whole wedding dress shopping thing I did uh, we went for Alyssa's wedding dress last week I showed you guys me trying on wedding dresses so this week you guys get Brianna and I'm so excited for you guys to see her in the dresses she seriously looked gorgeous in every single dress so I was super excited for you guys to see that and also I did go house hunting I went to one house um, and I vlogged it for you guys. I'm gonna have to like do a little explaining on this house uh, So you guys can like get our vision for it But anyway, if you guys want to watch us dress shopping and house hunting and I have tons of wedding updates about the venue My dress all that kind of stuff then just keep watching So before I go, I'm gonna show you super quick what I got Brie for her birthday So I wrapped this little present and basically it's actually the same bracelet as this one this which says be still and no she really wanted it so I got her that she also really requested that um, I get her like a cactus plant um, for her classroom so I got her that and then I got her she wanted a princess sash and then I got these crowns and we can all decorate them to wear today so that's what I got her I'm running super late so I gotta go Thanks. Just got to the dress store. Yay! <laughs> Hi! It was so many dresses. Hi! Happy birthday! Thank you. Anna just gave us these. I haven't took a date yet, but I can't wait. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, a long letter. This is, I'm gonna cry. She got us a little calendar and it's, <laughs> it's almost crap on camera. It's a nice little date. I love this. Wow. And this says hi. Hi. <gasps> oh my gosh. I should try that on. That is so pretty. <laughs> What's this deep in there? Oh yeah, she could try that. She might like that. It's very similar. Look at this runway for Brie to walk on. Wow. This is fancy. Do you want to do my vlog? <laughs> Caitlin's my uh, number one, my number one fan. <laughs> you guys are so cute. She sent me like a Snapchat of her and her family like watching my um dress video. It was so cute. <gasps> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, that's stunning. Oh, that's so that fits pretty. Pretty. Yeah, but this is the one that you wanted. Yeah. Let me see. Oh my gosh. Looks like really intense. Looks very good on you. It does. That looks so pretty. Maybe that's not your style though. Maybe the dress that you always wanted. Shattering dreams. It looks nice on you again, but it's not. Oh, the back, I think. Like the, I think she doesn't like the shimmer, probably. I like the other one better than this. Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah. No, no. Yeah. That, that, one's so pretty. that one's so pretty. Can you add something like? She said I could put sleeves on it. I like. I like that better than the. I like that. Oh. I like that open. Look at that lace. That is pretty. That's, That's so pretty. I, really I love like that, that one. one. That one I gives me that like chills. Yeah. Oh, that is so gorgeous. 
Perfect. I like this one. That's gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Oh, like Pretty. Too. With those sleeves. Can you do those sleeves for yes, that one? Yes, I was telling her that we could do the same sleeves on the other one. Yeah. This is like what I always t-shirt myself in. I think that's why. Is it, it open? Exactly like your dress. Oh, you're right on. <laughs> oh, that's so pretty. Oh, that's really pretty. Oh, that's totally different. Not for you. Stunning. I mean, it's gorgeous. Yeah, it is. Mm -hmm. It is. It's gorgeous. Yeah, that's stunning. <laughs> I don't know. We're trying to run. I know, they all look so nice. <laughs> <laughs> the and this has doesn't. That under thing, what she was saying, like the other one. Oh, oh yeah. The under oh. oh, the and back the is so pretty. I don't know at all. Like, that uh, is really pretty. I didn't mean, see that. It's really pretty. Yeah. Sorry, I, keep, I, mean, I'm really I don't like that. Thing in the middle like the there, lot, in the front. Though. Oh yeah. Has that thing that you what? Like, yeah. like yeah. wait, no, that's very, simple. Very simple. It reminds you of a Cinderella story. It's yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It's like very simple. simple. Yeah. Simple. yeah. yeah. Pretty. Ooh, that's pretty too. Too simple. Too simple. <laughs> <laughs> Next to the other one, the shiny one you yeah, just saw. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, that, that like yeah, flew so nice. Oh, yeah. But it looks. It's like very nice. Princessy, yeah, like it's, it's really very pretty. Princess. Yeah. Yes, it oh, really that's pretty. pretty. That's, that's so stunning. pretty. Wow, I love that. I love that. Are you saying yes to the dress? Are you saying yes? I guess. I'm the show. Yeah, I guess. Our decorating, you our crown. Are you holding it? Are you holding it with all of us yeah. next to you? Yes. Okay. Yay. Maybe we should go from yeah, so this decorating. Can sure. we take a picture here? Okay. All right. I just put to my crown on. You want to just stand on. in front of the dress? Yeah. It's like super bright in here, so it's kind of hard yeah. to see. Yeah. All right, guys. So I just got home from dress shopping. This is like the same clip as the intro because like I said, the intro got all messed up. I'm gonna start with the wedding updates first and then I'm gonna show you guys what I got for my bridesmaids and then we will get into the house hunting. So basically, I did find my venue. I didn't vlog it because um, when we went to visit it, I just kinda had a feeling that it was gonna be the one. And we went, I was so excited and I just couldn't contain my excitement. I'm still on the hunt for a videographer, so if you guys can find one that you know of, like in the tri-state area, so someone who is in like New York, New Jersey, Connecticut, that area, that would be amazing. I've been hunting for one, but they're all either like super, super expensive or the style of it is just not really like what I'm going for. So I'm having a hard time with that. Um, but I'm also in the midst of like making the save the dates. So I'm super excited for that. And I did say yes to the dress. Um, in my last video, I told you guys, I said I said 90% yes to the dress. But after we booked the venue, I was like, I have to get this dress. It's perfect. So I called like immediately after we booked the venue, like we were driving out of the parking lot. And I was like, I'm getting the dress. So I just called them and they ordered it for me. So I'm really excited. I do have moments of getting really nervous about the dress because it is super different. Um, it's, I don't know how to explain it. It's very different. It's not anything that I really thought I would go for. Um, it's definitely my style because I actually picked out the dress. That's like the reason why I went to that bridal boutique. It was to try on that dress. And then the first dress I tried on, which you guys all loved, it was like the gray waters dress. It was so beautiful. So those are the two dresses. And it's just kind of funny that I ended up going with my instinct. Okay. So moving on to the house. Um, basically Connor and I either we want to build a house or we were thinking of buying like a really beautiful piece of property and getting like a tiny house or getting like a, a retro like trailer and like remodeling it and living there for like a few years and then like once we save more money build a house like build our dream house um, or we're thinking of buying like a normal house but like we most likely would have to flip it so basically this house that we looked at it was a house that we would have to flip i'm gonna do like a little play-by-play -play as you guys watch the clips because 
um, my voice was really weird. Sometimes when you watch back videos of yourself, you, you just are, I don't know what I was doing. I was talking in a really weird tone and it was just kind of annoying me. So we're just gonna pretend that didn't happen and I'm just gonna do a little voiceover of it. So let's get into the house hunting. All right, so the house is weird when you first walk in. These steps are right there. Like as soon as you walk in, it's like boom, steps. So basically what we were thinking of doing there is tearing down the wall so the steps are more open and the house just has more of an open vibe. And then the living room was pretty tiny, but again, we don't really want a huge house, so that was okay. And what we were thinking of doing is tearing down the living room wall because it connects to the dining room and the kitchen. So basically we were thinking of doing like a huge open floor plan of all of this. The kitchen was super, super tiny. The house was like 1400 square feet, but most of the square footage, not most of it, but a lot of it was in the basement. So then you make your way over to the yellow vintage bathroom. I love vintage, but I just don't know that I love yellow vintage. It's not really my thing, but I guess I could deal with it. I would feel bad taking all the tiling out because it is original, but it's also not my favorite. So I'd have to think about that. Then basically there was just two rooms on the bottom floor. And then when you go to the basement, my dad kept making like all these jokes of saying that like somebody was like in the house. So when we got to the bottom, uh, the steps in the basement, he freaked me out, which you guys will see right here. Basements, I hate basements. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> then going upstairs, this pink room would definitely be the master bedroom. Um, and doesn't have a master bath, but there was a bathroom next to it So what we were thinking of doing is tearing down the wall and then making the master Bedroom attached to the bathroom there and then extending the bathroom out that way we can like make a really nice master um, Bathroom and we would definitely do a lot of like renovating in this room and then Last but not least there was just another room on the top floor. So as you guys can see the house definitely has potential if we wanted to flip it. We just felt like it was like really overpriced for the size and for like the amount of work that we would have to do to it. So I don't think we're going to go with that house, but the property on it was gorgeous. And I think there was like five and a half acres and like all of the property around it was just stunning and it just smelled like so fresh. I'm so used to living in like a city. So I wasn't used to like this fresh country air. So it was really nice. I just don't think it was the house for us. Alrighty, so I wanted to show you guys super quick what I have gotten for my bridesmaids for the day of the wedding. I just feel like I am knocking so many tasks out of the way for the wedding. So um, I got them these robes because I feel like everyone on their wedding always has like matching robes with their bridesmaids. You guys can take the cute pictures and get ready with them. So I'm gonna throw one on quick so you guys can see what it looks like. So this is the robe and actually a company reached out to me and asked me if I wanted just like a free robe um, because I got engaged and I just kind of just wanted to like congratulate me. So I took a look at their website. Their website's called Pretty Bash and this was on it. And I saw they had it in pink and I was like, oh, I could totally get this for my bridesmaids. So I actually bought them for my bridesmaids in pink because I was just that obsessed with it. These are their peony robes. And when I told them how obsessed I was with these um, robes, they actually sent me a coupon code. So if you guys want to get these robes and like mind you guys, this is not sponsored at all. This is just like how excited I was about them. They sent me this coupon code. Um, basically, if you guys wanna get these robes, they ha they gave me a coupon for 60% off. So you guys can get these robes for $18. And I like highly suggest if you guys are getting married and you guys need like robes for your bridesmaids and yourself, definitely go to their website and use the code. I think they said the code is good until like December, but these are super cute, and even if you're not getting married, they have like a bunch of things on their website. So I definitely think it's worth it. Since I've been wedding planning, I've been trying to save as much money as possible, and like I've been searching for coupons and everything like that. So the fact that these are 60% off um, and only $18 each, it's just, I feel like you can't go wrong. But yeah, these are super cute. I love them so much, and I cannot wait for them um, to put these on and take pictures. 
So I just wanted to end the vlog off here, but I wanted to show you guys the end of the Cinderella song. I know this is so stupid, but the end of, um, so at the end of Cinderella, she walks out, like she gets married and like walks out to this song and I cannot find this song anywhere um, because I feel like, I know it's like a dream is your wish your heart makes, but it has like an extra something to it and I can't find this version anywhere. So let me know if you guys can find it because I feel like you guys are really good at finding things. So hold on, I'm gonna pull it up for you guys. It's this song, if you guys look on, on YouTube at this, it's called Cinderella Ending. It's this song. Okay, so I, it's like mixed with something else. It's a dream you wish your heart makes, but it's like mixed with something else, I think, and I can't figure out what it is. And I feel like it would be so cute to walk out of the wedding, like Connor and I, to that song. Or if you guys know of any other Disney songs that would be cute to walk out to, let me know. I feel like I'm always asking you guys for advice now because you guys are just so good at finding things and giving me advice and I so appreciate it. So that is it for today's video. I'm thinking next week of doing a vintage shopping video because it's been a while since I've done that. Thinking maybe I could take you guys like vintage jewelry shopping. I've been really into vintage um, jewelry lately so I feel like that would be fun. Let me know if you guys would like that. But I hope you guys are all having an amazing day and thank you guys so much for all your help and all your sweet comments and everything like that. I love you guys so much. See you guys next time. Bye!